Have you faced pushback from other Republicans on this? Do you hear things from other Republicans um, when there are no Democrats around uh, that uh, lead you to think the Republican Party may be more divided on this or may have a slightly different view on this? Um, does it create tensions for you between your view in general on partisan political issues and this issue? Well, I think there are several questions implicit in that. One. Um, and in front of the Supreme Court, I don't think it makes any difference. I think that the, the Supreme Court justices, uh, no matter whether I argued it or David argued it or we divided it up or a Democrat or uh, um, Paul Smith, who's argued the Lawrence versus Texas case, or you um, argue the case, I think the outcome, all, if they're provided that we're all equally good lawyers and make the right arguments and don't mess up when we're up there during our 30 minutes, um, which has happened to some people, not, not on any of us. So I don't think, <laughs> I don't think that that will make a difference with the court. And if the, to the extent the question is, you know, what kind of a rough and tumble time am I having among the Republican circles, not so bad. Um, there are some people that really are, make it clear that they don't like what I'm doing, the betraying your principles, that sort of thing, which I think is, I'm happy to ask, be asked that question because I'd like to explain why it is not a betrayal of, of the principles of the party of Abraham Lincoln. Um, David Cameron, Prime Minister of England, um, said that he is in favor of gay marriage, not despite the fact that he's a conservative, but because he's a conservative. Um, so, but some people don't like what I'm doing, but I'm anxious for the dialogue. And I'm, I, I think that I can maybe be listened to, to by some people who wouldn't listen to somebody else. Not, I'm not better with everybody, and, and no one is, but I think it's really important that we have that kind of, uh, and, we, and we, have, we, we are working hard throughout the country to get Republicans, conservatives, to come out, if so to speak, on this issue, um, Dick Cheney. Uh, Ken Melman, who is chairman of the Republican National Committee, has come out. Other Republicans have come out. Several Republicans in New York, in the state Senate, voted for the passage of that law. So we're working hard on that. And if I think, I think that if some people are going to be hostile to me about it, that's just too bad. I mean, if you have, um, if you believe about this issue as strongly as I do, I think you better not be pushed off the street. You know, you can't uh, duck the controversy. But I think that it does give me an opportunity to talk to audiences, and that's part of the educational mission um, that David and I felt was a big part of this case.